VTiger CRM tutorial for beginners. Hi guys, this is Speak About Digital, and welcome to this video on how to use VTiger CRM. VTiger CRM is a powerful customer relationship management software that helps businesses manage their contacts, sales, and marketing in one place. Whether you're a small business owner or part of a large enterprise, this tutorial will guide you through the basics of using VTiger CRM. In this tutorial, we will walk you through the basics of VTiger CRM. We will show you how to create an account and provide an overview of the features and functionalities of VTiger CRM. Additionally, we will demonstrate how to add leads, contacts, and tasks in VTiger. We have a lot to cover in this video, so let's get started with the tutorial. To begin using VTiger CRM, the first step is to create an account. You will find the link down below in the description. So, go to the description of this video and click on the first link you find there. This will take you to the correct homepage. Once you're on the homepage, enter your email address in the provided field and select the Get Started with VTiger button to proceed. Upon clicking the button, you'll be directed to the Plans and Pricing page. Here, you can review the different plans and choose the one tailored to your needs. Once you've made your choice, click on the Start Free Trial button to initiate your trial period. The next step is to verify your email address. To do this, access your Gmail account and find the email sent to you by VTiger. Open the email and click on the Confirm My Email button. After clicking this link, you'll be redirected to another page while VTiger verifies your email address. After successful email verification, a registration page will be displayed. Here, you will need to provide additional information such as your first name, last name, company name, and a secure password. Click the Continue button to proceed after filling in the requisite details. The final step involves personalizing your account. Follow the on-screen prompts to customize your VTiger CRM account to your preferred settings. Once your account has been personalized, you'll be redirected to your account dashboard. The dashboard, which is the heart of VTiger CRM, is designed with user-friendly features to streamline your customer relationship management tasks. At the top of the dashboard, you will find a comprehensive top menu with various tabs, each providing access to a particular section of VTiger CRM. The Leads tab is a pivotal tool for managing prospective customers. Here, you can add new ones, view existing ones, update their status, and monitor their journey until they become customers. The An tab serves as an organized repository for managing all your customer contacts you can swiftly search through customer information as needed. The Organizations tab plays a vital role in managing all the organizations or companies your business interacts with. You're able to add new organizations, modify their details, and keep tabs on their interactions with your company. The Tasks tab is a crucial tool for managing your to-do list, allowing you to create new tasks, assign them to team members, set deadlines, and monitor their status. The Import feature offers the capability to import data from other sources into the VTiger CRM. This could range from contacts and organizations to leads or any data pertinent to your CRM requirements. The Reports tab is your central hub for insights and analytics. Here, you can generate various reports to analyze sales performance, customer behavior, lead conversion rates, and more. The Dashboard is the main interface you encounter upon login. It offers a condensed view of various metrics and activities. The Documents tab is the place to manage all your business-related documents, such as contracts, invoices, and marketing materials. The Deals section is designed to help you track all your sales opportunities. This includes adding new deals, updating their stages, and watching their progress until closure. Lastly, the Cases tab provides a platform for handling customer issues or inquiries. You can create a new case, assign it to a team member, and follow its progress until resolution. This comprehensive dashboard provides all the tools needed to manage your customer relationships effectively. Each tab in the VTiger CRM dashboard plays a vital role in ensuring an efficient and effective customer relationship management process. Now, let's see how to add a lead in VTiger. Adding a lead in VTiger CRM is a simple process. To do this, go to the top bar and click on the Leads tab. This action will direct you to the Leads page where you can view any pre-existing leads if any have been added previously. To add a new lead, simply click on the Add Lead button which prompts a pop-up window to appear. The window will contain various fields that you need to fill in, including the first name, last name, 
company name, primary email, and phone number. Also, you will need to provide the name of the lead. After the necessary information has been filled in, click the Save button to finalize. Once saved, the newly added lead will appear in your leads list and you will be redirected to the page of that particular lead. Here, you can add further details about the lead as needed. This systematic and user-friendly approach makes vTiger an excellent tool for lead management in your business. Next, let's see how to add a contact in vTiger. Adding a contact in vTiger is a straightforward process, allowing you to keep track of your customers and business associates. To begin, navigate to the top menu and click on the Contacts tab. This will take you to the Contacts page. Here you can see any existing contacts if you previously added any. To add a new contact, click on the Add Contact button located at the top right corner of the screen. A pop-up window will appear asking for information related to the contact. In this window, you will need to fill in several fields. These include the contact's first name, last name, email address, phone number, and the organization they are associated with. The Assign To field allows you to assign the contact to a team member. The Lifecycle Stage field is where you specify the phase of your relationship with the contact, such as whether they are a lead, marketing qualified lead, sales qualified lead, etc. The status field can be used to indicate the current state of the contact, whether they are in the cold, warm, or hot stage. Once you have filled in the necessary fields, click on the Save button at the bottom of the window. The contact will then be added to your contacts list with the information you provided. This systematic approach ensures an efficient and effective process for managing your contacts in vTiger. Next, let's see how to add a task in vTiger. To manage your workflow efficiently in vTiger, you can add tasks and assign them to your team members. Start by navigating to the top menu of your vTiger dashboard and click on the Tasks tab. This action will take you to the Tasks page, which displays any pre-existing tasks that you may have. To add a new task, search for the Add Task button, usually located at the top right corner of the screen, and click on it. A pop-up window will appear with various fields to fill in. First, enter the name of the task in the given field. Then proceed to assign the task to a specific team member by entering their name in the specified field. Subsequently, estimate the time you expect the task to take and input it. After that, select the due date and time for the task completion. Next, choose the stage of the task, such as pending, by selecting from the drop-down list. Identify the priority level of the task, such as high, medium, or low. Additionally, you can specify the location where the task is to be carried out, if applicable. The task can be linked to certain milestones, so use the relevant drop-down to select the appropriate milestone. If the task is related to, or is a continuation of a previous task, you can choose the predecessor task from the drop-down list. Similarly, if the task is a subtask of a larger task, you can choose the parent task as well. Specify the type of task, like sales or marketing, from the task type drop-down. This helps in organizing and categorizing tasks. If the task is part of a project, enter the project name in the specified field. Lastly, provide a detailed description of the task in the task description field. This description should be clear and concise, outlining what the task entails and any relevant details that the assignee needs to know. Once all the required details have been filled out, click on the Save button at the bottom of the pop-up window. This action will add the new task to your task list in vTiger, and it will appear in the dashboard of the individual to whom it has been assigned. This streamlined process makes task management in vTiger efficient and user-friendly. And there you have it, a beginner's guide to using vTiger CRM. If you want to try it out for yourself, you can sign up using the first link in the description. I would really appreciate that, and thank you. I hope you found it useful and learned something new. So again, if you found this video helpful, please give me a thumbs up, and if you have any questions at all, please comment below. I try to answer all the comments the best I can. Thanks for watching, and...